Hey you guys, it's Jono here. I got bored last night, so I decided to try out a new game called Ice. I was just looking around in the Android Play Market, and this game is only available on Android in the Play Market. Sorry, iPhone users, if you guys are my subscribers, that's too bad for you. This is a pretty simple game. Somebody, the dude, uh, m made this for some kind of a game contest. So it's extremely, extremely simple gameplay, but the logic is actually really fun. And I think that the engine could be used for a more complex game later on. So this is actually a really cool, interesting game. It's a fun game if you're just like single player, maybe don't have an internet connection and just want to do something that will kill a bunch of time. This is a quick way to kill some time. Now I've sped this up to about 200%, actually over 200% because the gameplay is really long and you're mostly spending a lot of time waiting for your little dots to move around from point to point. So I don't want you guys to have to sit and wait through that while I explain the gameplay and the strategy. So I went ahead and sped it up super fast so you can just get a really good idea of what's gonna happen and you don't have to sit and wait through all of it like I had to for recording. Okay, so what's happening here is only the connected bases can be captured by me. I start with one base, my enemies start with one base. This is a lot like Chinese checkers except for there's bases. So you have to keep on moving from base to base. The strategy in the beginning is to get all the bases as close to you and then start moving in a line in a circle around those bases. So you see I've got a triangle in the center and then I'm gonna go start trying to pick bases that either have a low number already or if there's two or three different characters fighting there, I wanna go and sit on the outside and wait for them to get done fighting and when they're both weakened, go in and take the base. I'll show you that tactic a little bit later in the video. I had a really good example of it. For now, I'm just trying to get as many bases as possible. I'm trying to get uh, my attack higher and my speed higher. You don't need to worry about your health in this game very much. If you get in a long game and you have a lot of upgrades, go ahead and throw them on there. But for the most part, do your speed and do your attack first. You want speed because you need to get to those bases fast and start capturing them. Whoever gets the most bases fastest is going to win. So you need to get the triangle formation in the center, start moving around from there. Then you can see that I'm going after bases that have a low score on them. So they have a small number. Bases that have just been captured will have about 450 or 500 points on them. So if you see that a base has just been captured, you can just wait a second until they leave it and then go take it out from under them because it'll have a nice low score on there. There's other tactics I use too, like if one base is, like if I'm attacking one base and then the enemy comes and starts attacking it and I can't finish it, I'll go attack another base right next to it and then I'll go back and forth between those two bases because the logic on the computer is not really that smart. So I'll go to one base, get it down, they'll chase me over there. Then I go to the other base, get it down, they'll chase me over there. And slowly I can get one base down to zero. And then after it's at zero, I get 500 points and I can move on and it'll take them a little while to take it back. Now this is that instance where I told you that I just held off. See, I put a little blob there on the side. I let all three of those dudes fight it out. You can see their army dwindles, dwindles. There's almost nobody left. And then I go in and I take it. And actually I got lucky, the enemy just totally walked away from it too. So that was a really easy battle, I didn't even have to fight whatsoever. And I still have plenty of dudes left in my mob to go protect my base and take other bases. So after this it's pretty much clean up, I got a couple of enemies left, I got a straight line from the bottom to the top where I'm going to meet him. So I take his home base there, I go and I get the base underneath it as well. Then I'm going to go right back up to the top and start taking everybody in a line and finish this game. It's a really, really simple game you guys, it's not easy to win but it's not hard either once you kind of get it down the bases as you take them will start to spawn little dudes so you can kind of make some logic where if you have dudes that are going to be on the way to your next base you can choose your base based on that so if i have a bunch of dudes spawning in the middle it's going to make sense for me to go where those dudes are already closest to not necessarily where my mob is closest to my mob might be really far away but i have a bunch of dudes out in the middle that are just kind of hanging around so this is a really fun game, you guys. Super easy, super simple, great way to waste some time. I actually enjoyed it quite a bit, so big shout out to the developer for making it. Really good job. I'm going to go ahead and wrap it up now, you guys, because this is just about over. You notice I didn't upgrade my health one time the whole time I was in here. I didn't need to. If you use good strategy, you won't. But that's my video, you guys. Thanks, everybody, for watching. Thanks to all my awesome subscribers, and please subscribe if you don't already. And that's it from me, Jono. Peace!